What's up everyone? This is a Bush Garden Junkie here and we have our buddy here, security guard. Doing? Wet rainy day and we love these guys for working here. Thank you. Thank you. Love you. April Fools guys. Well, yeah, it is April 1st. And it is her 51st birthday. It's a little rainy here. Thank you. And uh, we're gonna spend some wet times at, at Bush Gardens. Garden. everyone yeah we got ride uh, 15 and 16 in that's it 16 credits each on Iron Glossy so uh, it is drizzling a little bit and trust me the rain at 76 miles an hour hurts a little bit it's like a mosquito sting or something but hey you'll definitely love it back row first thing in the morning when she hasn't warmed up the wheels and tracks and she's not going full full throttle it's always great watch her as she goes yeah people riding in the rain well the sun has come out on this glorious april fool's day and uh Needless to say, we got in a couple of runs in the rain and a couple of runs out of the rain. So uh, that would make it um, 15, 16, 17, and 18. Four runs so far. We got two more runs to hit our goal of 20 by the end of today. Who knows, we might even get a little bit more. But yeah, so far 18 credits on Iron Gwazi. And still, still, my favorite and best ride here so far. Well guys, this is one of the good reasons why we ride Montu. One, it's a great ride, but two, we get a good view of the parking lot and preferred parking is empty. That general parking is empty. I do not enjoy it! Look at that. Uh, like one bus. One bus and one camera. And here we go! It's like Dash and Chase are just chilling out here today. We're all around today. <laughs> and I don't know what this uh, turtle's playing around doing. Funny. What's up, everybody? Yeah, 20 runs in Iron Gwazi so far. So that means all together combined, we got 40 credits. Yay! I've never figured out this credit thing, but either way, rides, credits, however you want to count them, we got 20 each. It's such an amazing ride. And yeah, now it's getting warm. 
and she's been open for about three hours now so yeah she's gonna get a little bit faster we decided to go up about the fifth row or sixth row something like that um, because the back row gets a little bit too intense in the afternoon catch you guys later we're gonna catch some more rides and we may come back to Iron Gwazi a little bit later on today So folks, we got another train coming and right there is the nice outer bank turn right after the first drop. See, they're going up. And right there was the death hole. And they're going to come hopping over here. Oh, yeah, a little more over here. And then they stop. Uh, folks, if you watch Dan from Midway Mayhem, he was claiming that there were some pink chickens missing. Well, Dan, they're missing here too. Uh, it does look like they put a whole bunch of new grass here. But yeah, we have pink chickens missing. And uh, Dan, just as a uh, reminder, uh, they are missing. They are actually put away safely because of the bird flu. So, yeah, Dan, they're missing here, too, at Bush Gardens. Hope you can find them soon. Yeah, Lori's Landing is still closed, and here we actually have a sign. At Bush Gardens, we're committed to ensuring our animals live in a safe and healthy environment as a precaution due to the presence of avian flu in wild birds in Florida. We have temporarily closed this exhibit in an effort to keep our birds healthy and thriving we appreciate your understanding and yes we do understand i got many birds at home and uh yes it, it, it is good that they keep it closed because of the avian flu in the wild birds in florida so hopefully hopefully this will be resolved soon and we'll be able to get back and see our loric eats There they go. My little fella. And here they come. Well folks, it's been a while since we've been in the front row, so I'm gonna turn the camera around so you can see what we see.
Aren't they cute? Hi. Okay, guys, I'm sure you heard the rumors about Kumba. And, well, let me tell you one thing. They are just rumors. I don't think she's going to go anywhere anytime soon. And we're just going to wait for a train to come by here and show you. It may be a while. There, got him on tape. Yeah. <laughs> Film at 11. Just wait till the waterfall. <laughs> the wall and start spinning. Um, we're stuck. 
<laughs> We're stuck in a vortex. Oh, I think we're bouncing up. Oh, yay. Oh, Folks, if there's any doubt, look at that. There's people on Kumba. I say it's still running. Well, we got started real quick on this one. Thank you for watching my videos, Bush Gardens. I was talking about the Congo train station, and look at that, there's no train. The Congo train station is open. All the nice artwork again. Oh, and there's some even artwork in here too. Look at that. Yes, Pantopia definitely got a nice makeover. And uh, last time we were here, they were redoing this mural. Look, look, it's like that, but way, 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 way. Beautiful job that they did. Yeah, she did a wonderful job repainting that mural, touching it up. Tippy toes. Not even my tippy toes. I can. Not anymore. So, 
That one is a real old ride. Yep. It's been here since almost day one, I think. Yep. But it's a Schwarzkopf. As opposed to that B&M over there. I don't know the difference between Schwarzkopf and B&M, but... Well, either way, they're both running. And there you go, a nice good image of the mural there. Yeah, so did I. <laughs> Something dripped on me up here. Now, wasn't that exciting? Seeing the ground come up real fast and contemplating your life? Yes. Hi cutie. Thompson Gazelle's and a cheetah hunt. What a combination. I don't know, I think the cheetah would win over the gazelles, but they seem to be unharmed. Very alert. And I think the cheetah's gonna come back pretty soon. Yeah, there comes the cheetah again, and there it goes. There goes the cheetah. Totally missed the gazelles. Good thing. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of them. Well folks, I think we're about to call it a day. It's like 5, 10 o'clock, uh, 5, 10 in the afternoon. 5, 10 o'clock, yeah, 5, 10. All right guys, I think we're about to call it a day. We'll, we'll go ahead and keep that blooper in for, for keepsake reasons. But yeah, it's 5, 10 in the afternoon. We're uh, heading through the children's area to hit Aranguazi for one more ride and uh, head on home and have a birthday cake. Yay! Guys, it's been a wonderful day. Uh, this week has actually been a great week for Bush Gardens uh, if you're a local because there's no crowds. Everything today was like five, five ten. minutes, ten minutes, or basically a walk-on. 
yes, we walked on so many rides, it's not funny. So, we're gonna go ahead and head on out and get another ride on Iron Gwazi, make it number 21, and we'll catch you on the flip side.